hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's reading this is gonna be uh what's coming in love so we have five cards choose one or two or three cards a uh, shoes has many of the cards that you feel drawn to so we can see what's gonna be happening to you in love i'll see you at your pile Hello everyone from group number one with the card number one, which is this one. Let's see what's coming for you in love, everyone. So, you guys, you chose this group because there's a lot of passion coming to you in love. Maybe for a lot of you, if you are in a serious relationship or starting a relationship, this could be that you are going to be enjoying so much a lot of... Uh, passion there's going to be a lot of passion in your in your marriage in your new relationship with that crush with that person that you're thinking of there's going to be a lot a lot of passion for some of you it could be a wonderful night it could be you know that you finally make out that you finally kiss each other that you finally you know have that passion that you desire whether you're married single or whatever you could be having a very romantic dinner or you could be having one night stand or you could be having you know just like a normal date night or whatever with your partner like however you are single married or whatever it doesn't matter there's passion coming into your life there's this amazing energy of like really feeling fulfilled with that person loving each other really enjoying your sexuality as well like it depends for each person the different type of relationship that you guys have but definitely this is a very very good type of energy and it means that you guys are going to be getting fulfilled failed uh, in whatever feeling or desire or passion that you want you guys are going to be getting fulfilled mint is going to be good for you you guys are going to love it this is very very good energy you guys from group number one very very good energy so hope you guys enjoyed let's go with card number two okay card number two which is this one oh so there's a wish fulfilled, there's a wish that is going to get fulfilled for you in the next couple of weeks. Like this is talking about a really amazing energy. Maybe a lot of you guys want to get moving together with that person or get back together with that person. Or it could be that you're, you know, you're like really fantasizing about this guy or this girl proposing to you or going into uh, your trip or something like that going to a trip or something like that like whatever wish that you have regarding the love situation if you have someone like i said it could be like a proposal it could be a wedding it could be that maybe you're wanting to move in together with that person maybe you're wanting to get pregnant uh if you're not with anybody this could mean that you're finally going to be getting that someone it means that you probably are going to be meeting someone very very soon this could mean that you're going to get a wish fulfilled it doesn't matter if you're single or not you are going to be getting your wish fulfilled this is this is a, a happy energy so you're going to be really happy about it you're going to really love this like this is really something that you're going to be enjoying and you're just going to be so happy about it you're going to get your wish fulfilled doesn't matter what it is it's regarding about love and family and you know just being happy with the with the love situation maybe having the night of, of a passion maybe kissing that person right maybe that your crush notices you whatever it is that you want is going to get fulfilled group number two card number two i hope you guys enjoy let's go with card number three okay so we have this card card number three so what's coming in love for you group number three with this situation this is telling me that you guys are going to be well 
going through a very difficult time this could be getting disappointed being disappointed maybe finding out about a cheating maybe finding out about betrayal or something like that like for a lot of you this situation is just very very difficult or it could be just something so sad something so disappointed maybe for a lot of you this could be you know something regarding your partner that you're not going to enjoy that you're just you know it's going to it's going to be a sad situation for some of you this is talking about like feeling you know betrayed or something like that if you are single this could be you know experiencing more of that sadness experiencing more of that loneliness experiencing you know insecurities about your love situation that could be as well like for a lot of you this is just not good news this is just something difficult whether you're single or have a partner already this is just something that you guys are going to struggle with something negative something difficult something you know um insecurities suspicious whatever it is that you were going to be feeling this is represented by the three of swords so yeah it's a difficult it's a difficult energy so yeah you guys from group number three let's go with group number four this one okay nice nice so there's a lot of movement with you guys group number four there's a lot of movement a lot of prosperity with this card this is talking about like really just moving forward uh building something really strong i do see that a lot of you guys this could be that you guys are moving forward to a, a stronger phase maybe you guys are going to be you know in a better position with your love situation maybe you're going through things but you're being strong about them and you guys are going to be growing from them this could be learning an important lesson in your marriage in your in your you know like a uh, boyfriend and girlfriend type of situation uh if you're single this could be learning to love yourself being a very strong character very strong person someone that knows how to deal with their loneliness or knows how to deal with their you know singleness or whatever like you guys are going to be learning a, a lesson about what you're going through right now or what was being happening in your love situation you're going to be learning good amazing things about that and it's gonna make you prosper it's gonna make you move towards advance it's gonna you're gonna have successful energy with it so whatever it is that's going on you guys are gonna go through that and it's gonna bring you a good energy resistance strength so in the end whatever it is that is going on with you uh, or your partner whatever it is that you're feeling there's gonna be coming something good out of that okay Group number four. I hope you guys liked it. Let's go with group number five. This one. Interesting. So, group number five. If you're single, this just means you guys are going to be meeting someone. You guys are going to be meeting someone. You guys are going to be having a new girlfriend, a new boyfriend, having a new lover. Maybe uh, you guys are going to be getting married. If you are with someone right now, that could be that you could go a little bit more formal, the relationship. It could mean that you guys are going to be, you know, um, doing this thing and just making everything better. Like if you have a relationship right now, right? It could be like growing. That relationship could grow into a little bit, into something more formal, something more amazing something something more stable for other of you like i said if it's not marriage or anything like that it could just mean a new relationship or that you guys are going to go on a date or that you guys are going to be finding your soulmate definitely this just means love okay love union love union uh, marriage etc etc so whatever stage that you are in a relationship whether you're single or in a relationship already is just gonna you know advance you, you guys are gonna go up this step so it's a very very good energy you guys group number five i hope you guys enjoyed it give it a like subscribe and i'll see you in my next one bye